What's up, family? How we doing? Um, listen, this idea just hit me. I was in the shower, and um, you know how you think. You are now watching AK Debris on YouTube. Welcome back to the house of knowledge, wisdom, evolution, and revolution. Make sure to click the like button, smash the subscribe button, and leave a comment for the algorithm. Get comfortable, grab a bottle of water, and back to you, AK. This is Hannah, AK Debris, London. When you're in a shower, you get those shower... Thoughts, deep thoughts. I was thinking like, how come is it only a few people are doing this whole, um, if you want to call it that, stop the violence movement or, or speaking some sense into us, right? As, you know, so this message, <clears throat> this message I want to dedicate it to black men from the hood. If you're anything like me, if you're anything like me, you're a black man from the hood, you realize quickly the goal should be is to get out the hood and, and you feel like you can't stop the violence. But the thing is, once you get your chance, right, however you got it, I don't care how you get it, but you got it. And now you can afford to not be in the hood no more. One thing we all have in common, if you really, because it's nowadays, there's a lot of internet tough guys, a lot of, you know, these internet goons, right? Every time I say something, they want to come from my neck. How could you say that? I'm really from the streets. If you meet me, da da da. Shut up. Hear me out. So, I have a message to those internet goons. I don't know. If you really, like me, live that life, walk, walk that walk, and just talk that talk, then we have a few things in common. If you really did. Nine times out of ten, you have lost either a friend or a fellow soldier, a brother, a cousin, a distant cousin, a father, a son, maybe not even males, maybe females, maybe a sister, a girlfriend, a wife, whether they banged or gang banged, I mean, or they just were innocent bystanders. Because those happen a lot. Casualties of war. We all have them. But my question is, since we all have them, why is it only two, three people like Hassan Campbell, like um, Charleston White, why is it only one, two, three people speaking some sense into millions of y'all? I have to wonder because 
I just want to highlight a point. I'm not going to drag this video out too long. What make this idea... Hold on. What made me want to direct this video to Black Man from the Hood is... I'm just, I'm sorry, I'm just like you. But when there's a problem, I try to solve it. It's not going to be overnight, but I try to at least. But I stand and it feels like I'm in a, preaching to an empty room. It feels like I'm, excuse my friends, pissing in the wind. Meanwhile, a lot of y'all want to justify it to me, even though you've suffered the consequences already. We all know somebody lost. Here's, here's how I know. Here's what made me do it. A lot of y'all got in your bio, R.I.P. so-and-so. Back in the 2000s, it was on a shirt. You know, some so-and-so world. Long live so and so. Nowadays, you guys get a chain. You know, they got the this new stuff. It's a diamond circle, diamond frame, and in the middle, it's a picture. Instead of buying a chain or a shirt, you idiot, how about you take a stand with me? There's a lot of shirts and chains, but only a few people speaking against it. If we all speak against it, it'll be over like this. Am I lying? If you really walk that walk, not just talk that talk, then you know it's nothing good that comes from it. Yeah. I don't believe you internet tough guys, because if you really did walk such walk, you wouldn't be on the internet trying to tell me about it. Let's get that understood. Let's make that clear. And if you really did walk that walk, you would have experienced the horrors of such walk. Let me take the hat off. The horrors are not pretty. It's nothing but trauma and traumatized people. Mental health issues, undiagnosed. That's what the hood is. But my, my friend, my brother in Christ, don't justify it to me. I don't want to hear your justification because I don't want it to keep going. I don't want to hear a drill song no more. I don't even listen to rap no more. Hassan Campbell said, some in an old video I came across. And it made me laugh, but it's not that funny. Nowadays, in the music, it's all about being gangster, sure, but that's not what I'm talking about. Nowadays, you can't find a love song. I've been listening to old music. Because that's the vibe I want. Back in the day, they just wanted to love. Baby, I love you. Love. You broke my heart, but I still want you, da-da-da. Nowadays, if you show the slightest love to a female, they call you a simp. Meanwhile, the females that's rapping, and the males rapping both, there's no more love in music. All it is is 
finesse the end out of his bag, make him spend that on this P trick. Hmm? Oh, the... You go to the guys, maybe they're wiser. China? Nope. I just F your B, throw some money on that P, make her shake that. Come on, bro. No more love in society or music. Just a flex war. You're too busy flexing. And, 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 and even the gangsters, it's like Hassan says, what are you fighting for? These gangs started out to protect the people. Right now, we need to protect the people from them. Makes you think, before you buy a, a R.I.P. chain or a shirt, how about you take a stand with me and use your voice? Because if we all stand, I know a lot of us. It's a lot of us. If we all take a stand, things will change. Bring back the Soldier Boy era. Snapbacks and swag. That was a good time. Now everybody want to be tough. Get out of my face. I lost people. You want to go live that life? Be my guest. Have fun. You will be broke and you will end up in a, a tombstone or behind bars. You lead your own life. It's not my job to tell you. All right. Hit like, smash subscribe, check the last video, watch the documentaries. My name is AK. And I might hit you with that. No. This is the House of Knowledge, Wisdom, Evolution, Revolution. Hit the like button. I'm done. Don't justify nonsense to me. I read my comments sometimes. And I'm losing, you know, you a grown man trying to justify this to me when I'm speaking against it. You are lost. Don't let these idiots discourage you, all right? If you're a man, you take a stand and say what you believe in. Don't, don't be a sheep. Or actually, you love being a sheep. I'm not going to wake you up. Why stress myself? I'm back to being funny, funny videos. I'm done with these topics. Peace out. Tell me.